What's going on y'all man? Welcome back to another video. It is your boy Fat Cat of course bringing you another one man and today we got a special 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 treat for you guys. So as you guys know man I like to bring a lot of different things to the you know to, to, the, to the channel and everything else man so uh I actually somebody reached out to me not too long ago and said hey man you know I, got, I think you're gonna, you I got something you might like so I was I checked out his page and he was right so today we're gonna go ahead and do uh, a, a feature on his car first check out these rolling shots and then we'll come back and talk to the owner man let's go And there you go, man. Look at that. We got my man, Jesus. Yep. Jesus. However you want to pronounce it. If you're Hispanic, you can say Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> and if not, then you can say Jesus. Uh, or Jesus, man. But this is his beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Hellcat Challenger. Wrapped, as you guys see. We, I mean, we didn't even got to explain what it is. But you see, it's wrapped in the Cars-themed wrap, man. This thing is beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So of course, man, we're gonna bring Hesu in, and we're gonna talk about everything, man. So first of all, what year is this? It's a 2015 Hellcat first gen. 2015 Hellcat. Okay, and did you buy it brand new or? I bought it used with 4,000 miles. Wow. Uh, about a year and a half ago. Oh, well, 4,000 miles. 4,000. So it's big thing. So at least you know it's safe to say that this car probably was not molested. No, no. Not not that bad, especially for 2015, only 4,000 miles, meaning that thing was garage yeah, kept. Yeah, it was garage. Yeah. Yeah. So. All right, man. So let's talk about what was the inspiration and everything else to do this uh, to do this wrap. That's I mean, that's that's the first thing we're gonna talk about. That's the obvious thing. Yeah. Then we'll talk about everything else is well, done. Originally, I was going to go with a different theme. Let me get you this way. Let me let me get you this way first, so that way we can get the. Uh, so I was gonna go right. with a different theme. I was gonna go with a Superman theme. Okay. Um, and the reason why I was gonna go with that theme is I live in Groveland, mm. and um, there's a, a kid that 
he's he's autistic autistic and right. he dresses up as Superman. Okay. And he goes out and picks up garbage and makes sure that the town wow. is clean. But then I figured, you know, I need to think something bigger. Hmm. I love doing charities for kids. I have five kids of my own. Wow. So, you know, I look out back in, I'm from Connecticut, so I used to donate a lot of money to the boys and girls clubs and I used to look out for a lot of the kids. Dope. That's super so dope. I said, why not go and do something for kids? So I figured Lightning McQueen, what kid does not like Lightning exactly. McQueen? Exactly. So I went with Lightning McQueen and uh, I mean it's been what three weeks that I've had the car and the car has gone viral, has gotten so many attention from a lot of different people. And three weeks. for every show that I go to, I honor one kid to sit in Lightning McQueen and wow. take a picture. Wow, man, that's super dope, man. So you can see, man, he's giving back to the kids in the community. So he's only had this rap three weeks, you said? Three and a half weeks? Yeah, three and a half weeks. Three and a half weeks. And let me tell you, I could have vouch for this. We we just met. I mean, obviously, you know, we talk on Instagram, but we just met like in person, probably 20 minutes ago. And in that time frame, I say at least three people personally that I've seen has stopped to take a picture of this car. <laughs> so I mean that is that's just crazy. I mean that's the attention that this car gets, man. It's a super dope rap. So what what company did the rap for you? Uh, Supreme Rap. It was actually uh, it was a combination between two companies. Supreme okay. Rap did the uh, side logo. They did the the little stickers, the hood, the top, and then uh, affordable signs of Clearmont. They actually went and found me the little uh, LS decals, like the '95 in the front, the Lightning Boat and the uh, stickers in the back where it says Rusty's with the bumper. Right. So, so they found all of that and did that for you. Yeah, so both companies came together and was the masterpiece that they came That's up. pretty dope, man. So look, I'm, and I'm going to ask, I'm just going to ask you this. I just thought about it right now. Do you think that there could be any issues with as far as like the actual, who's that, Disney or whatever that, that yeah, like copyrights I and stuff actually, like that? I sent um, Disney an email. Okay. Um, I'm still waiting for their response, but um, there's another guy in Connecticut that actually wrapped his mm -hmm. um, Lightning McQueen, but it was a Charger, mm -hmm. and he had gotten all the rights from Disney, so it's just a waiting time. Okay. Now, so, so, so they don't have an issue with you doing it. Exactly. You just You just got to get the permission yeah, and everything else. Yeah, just got to get the permission. Okay. So we went ahead and did it with, before the permission, but it's all good because we know we're going to get the permission. Exactly. It's coming. <laughs> but that's all good, man. Like I said, this is beautiful, man. Um, I will tell you, man. The one thing my son did ask me was like, "Does it have the? Does it say Kachow on it?" <laughs> Not yet, but the license plate's coming. It's coming. It's okay, coming. cool, man. But other than that, man, like I said, this thing is beautiful, man. Like I said, it's a 2015 Hellcat. Let's talk about uh, the rest of everything else we got on here, man. So, what? First of all, what wheels are these? I went with drag radios all around. Um, everybody keeps telling me, "Why did you go with drag radios in the front? It's right. a real, real drive car." Right. But I wanted all the wheels to look exactly the same. Gotcha. So I didn't want to have two or two different sets of tires. So I went with the Nittle NT05 um, drag radios all the way around. But what what actual wheels are these, though? These are the Demon rims. The Demon rims. Yeah. Okay. Exactly. That's what I was getting. At. I mean, I knew that. I just wanted to make sure that, you know, it was set on the camera. These are 275s in the front and 315s in the back. And 315s in the back. They hook pretty good. For a car with this much power, no. <laughs> it's still a little tough. She still struggles, but you know, I took it to the track and she ran pretty good numbers. So, you know, I'm happy with it. Do you want to put them out there? What, what, what did we run? Uh, it ran, uh, the first run, it ran 12.3. Okay. And then after, I, I really got used to the car and did 11.9. 11, nine. 11 okay. And I think she has a little bit more, but with the tire spinning and everything. How about I say, as a 12.3, that means that's definitely either you're getting used to it or definitely you're not hooking. Yeah, yeah, it's so. definitely not hooking. So right. I'm thinking of changing out the back tires and go with something more sticky like right. Mickey Thompson's and stuff. That's dope, man. So again, we got so we got 315s back here, Nittles, NT what NT uh, four or five is that right? NT 05s. NT 05s, yeah, that's what I meant. <laughs> Super dope. So what what color is the car originally? It's uh, torrid red. Oh, it, oh, okay. Yeah. So, so is this the actual color of the car right here? Yes, this is the actual. So color, this is just oh. And this is just decal. I figured. Oh, ah, um, okay. The car's red, and it would have been perfect for like. It was perfect. Green. So oh, okay, I, I see. I so it's not an entire rap. rap, it's really just like just decals. decals everywhere. Yeah. Perfect, 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 man. You got the rusties in the back. Look at that. We got anything done to the uh, exhaust? No, actually, all I did was a mid muffler delete. So you got I mid muffler don't think delete. I can do anything more because it'll just sound ridiculously loud. Uh, and my neighbors my will hate me. <laughs> They'll be alright, man. They get used to it. My neighbors are used to it by now. 
But anyway, but yeah, but Mid-Muff Delete, I mean, obviously, if you just want a nice rumble and everything else and not be obnoxious, that's yeah, that's pretty much I the way to go. That's perfect, yeah. yeah, that's really, really the way to go. So, yeah, man, this thing is top-notch, man. Like I said, they did a really good job. But what was the company's name again that did it? Supreme Raps. Supreme Raps. Uh, okay, we'll get, we'll get that in there. Supreme Raps. So make sure you guys go check them out, man, because they did a really, really, really good job on this car. Man. Do we have anything uh, uh, done motor-wise, or is it pretty much stock? Uh, motor-wise, uh, I put an EFE intake on it. Um, I actually, I purchased the uh, pulley, the 2.4 pulley for the supercharger. Uh -huh. My goal is to make the car a thousand horses. Okay. So, I mean, I, I did a drive shaft by um, uh, the drive shaft shop. Right. One piece. Um, I Basically, that's all I put on the car. but. You know, I have everything to put the car, okay. the injectors, everything to put the car to a thousand horses. Nice. So it's not installed yet. It's we just we have yet, the pieces no. to yeah. it. So, but in a minute here, we'll, if you don't mind, we'll take a look in, inside the motor and everything else, and mm -hmm. and look what we got it done in there. So this thing is cool, man. Like I said, it's super. It, 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 it's almost like it's it's done proper like they took it right out the cartoon and it was like well I was very very picky when it came right. to the car and I you know it has to be about kids um, they did right. send me about three to four proofs and I just kept sending them back um, I'm more of a perfectionist um, gotcha it, it like I said it's for the kids and um, I don't want just just you want to make sure it was right. I wanted to make sure that it was right. Exactly. So when they actually looked at it, it's not like oh okay that's just somebody trying, but it's like looking at it, it's like oh. It actually does look like Lightning McQueen. Yeah. yeah. And like I said, instantly, man, like I said, me just being here or, you know, 30 minutes now, like I said, at least three people stopped and took pictures yeah. and they said, oh my God, my kids love it. As a matter of fact, there was one kid who was yelling out the window. It was like, oh my God, I love Lightning McQueen, man. <laughs> and then about two other people stopped and it was like, man, my kid loves Lightning McQueen and this and that. So taking pictures of it. And then of course, I had a shameless plug and said, hey, go check out my YouTube channel. I'm doing a video on it right now. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I had to get my little plug in there too, man. But anyway, man, so let's talk about these lights that's going on here. What do we have in here? The lights are from Lighting Trend. Um, I went with the rings on the headlights. I went with the demon eyes inside. Right. And I also went with the Hellcat logo. That's nice, man. And you said, and who, who was it that did it again? Uh, Tyler, I don't know how to pronounce his last name. It's Tyler Jasensky, I think it is. Um, he's from um, Family's Garage. Right, yeah, yeah. Tampa, yeah uh, family, City. what is it, Family Generation? Family, family Generations Garage. Family Generations yes. Garage, right. That's, cause that, that's, uh, if you guys see my last video uh, with um, with Repo, uh, which is the orange or the gold mango uh, uh, Hellcat Challenger, he said the same thing, he went to him as well. Yes. Yeah. So same person, man, and like I said, I've been talking to him as well, so we might get something done here in a little bit. So you have, uh, uh, the well, the rings, the aim, the demon eyes, and then you also have underneath too, huh? So you got I the underglow. The grill, I have the underglow, and I have the inside the bay as well. I don't know if you guys can see that. It may not be dark enough, but uh, you can see the grill in there, the bottom grill. And you got the underglow. Is that all the way around the car? All the way around the car. And you got the and, they, and I see it. You got a yellow and uh, an orange, <laughs> yellow and red, yellow, yellow and orange. orange. Got to go with the man. This thing is tied in all the way around, man. That's super nice, man. Well, Jose, man, I mean, Jose, Jesus, man, he did a uh, uh, great job with the car, man. Like I said, I think it's, I think it looks great. Um, the the company did well. Looks, literally looks exactly like Lightning McQueen. Um, I don't think it could have came out any better, man. I don't think so either. <laughs> I, I think they hit it head on with the stickers, with the piston cup. Right. Um, I ordered my piston cup hood um, prop for it as well. Oh, nice. So... I mean, I think they did an awesome job, and um, I recommend them. Also, if I, um, I'm the president of Mopar for Life. Okay. If you join our group, they will give you 20% off on any work that okay. you get done on the vehicle. Mopar for Life. So do you guys have like an Instagram or Facebook or yes, anything like that? We have, it's actually a national club. We have okay. the Mopar for Life Car Club, which is on Instagram. Okay. Is it a paint job or is that a wrap? It's decal. I like it too. That's why I'm doing a video on it. 
I think uh, the second one I've seen with that, but uh, I don't think it was a uh, Charger. I think it was something. Uh, I think it was like an older car or something like that. It's not a Charger though. That's a Challenger. That's a Charger. <laughs> that one over there is a Charger. <laughs> so if you go on Instagram, it's um, Mopars for Life's Car Club. Okay. Um, and that's the national club. And then for the Florida one, it's uh, Mopars for Life Central Florida. Gotcha. And that's I'm the president of that club. Nice. So, and then my my Instagram is speed underscore by underscore you. Speed underscore by underscore you. Yes. And uh, so you, you guys are gonna be at the bottom of the screen. I'm gonna make sure I put all the info in there for you guys, man. Make sure you go check them out. Like I said, he got some dope pictures on there. I seen a couple pictures. Like I said, I went, obviously I went to go check out your page. A lot of pictures in there with kids and everything else, and in front of the school, in the park. Yes. Um. So I see you do a I lot did of a charity. There event. you go. I was. I did a charity event last weekend. I'm gonna go to Ace this weekend. Is for the kids back to school thing. Oh, dope. So that's gonna be another one that I'm gonna do over the weekend. Especially, I mean, I did the car for for kids. Um, I'm actually on the works with uh, the guy who runs uh, Cars for Coffee or Cars and Coffees. Right. We're trying to do a charity event for the Cancer Center over in Orlando nice. for kids. Damn, that's dope, man. Yeah. I like that, man. So this is literally dedicated for yes, the kids, definitely man. Definitely, it's dedicated for kids. Man, that is so dope, man. Let's go ahead and open up the hood, man. Let's check out what we got in there. <laughs> Another person, man. Like I said, this is non-stop. <laughs> non-stop, man. It actually People... has a VTEC under the hood. A v... <laughs> he said, if you didn't hear it, man, he said it has a VTEC under the hood. <laughs> if you guys don't know, that's the Honda. <laughs> so there you go, man. Again, as you guys know, that badge right there says it all. You... And even if it's stock, this says it all right here, man. You don't need anything else in that. But as you guys know, man, supercharged Hemi 6.2, and this is the uh, the EFE. The EFE. The EFE. Like? Yeah, yeah, EFE. Yeah. Do you like it? Actually, it uh, it works. I own a dyno, so I before you I own a dyno. Yes. Oh, okay. I own a shop in Connecticut. We do high performance cars. We built mm. one of the world's fastest pickup truck. Wow. It does uh, six seconds at 227 miles an hour. Say that one more time. Six seconds, 227 miles an hour. In a quarter. In a quarter mile. Jesus. Yes. It's a <laughs> Ford Ranger with a 2JZ motor in it. What? Yes. <laughs> so. Now, this is Connecticut. You don't have anything? You don't have a shop down I'm here? I'm moving my shop here to Florida. Well, I'm coming to see you yeah. when that happens. So I Man. own a dyno jet. So before I put the intake on, I it did uh, 619 to the wheels. And once I put the intake on, it did uh, 6, I think 648. Just with the intake? Just with the intake. Wow. So, I mean, I live by EFE. They, their numbers are run on spot. That's dope, man. You said you bought a pulley. You got the inject injectors yeah, I got coming. The injectors. I bought the pulley. I bought the uh, the lower crank pulley. Um, hmm. The catch can. I'm waiting for it to put it on as well. But it's been. I, I mean, I, I have a lot of projects going on right now. So yeah, yeah I understand that, one. man. So th this is the same lighting trends in here, right? With the yes. uh, yep. the lighting going same. around. Yep. They're all connected with this one and the one on the grill. Right. This is dope, man. So are you are you also with the Mopar Outlaws? I support our clubs. You support? I support all the clubs. Oh, all the clubs. Yeah. I got you. I'm a big supporter for everyone. We're all Mopar. Mopar should be all it's one, one family. family. Exactly. And that's just the way I look at it. Uh, you um, know what? 100% respect that. I was that. Outlaws for a few. They treated me very great. Um, but you know, it was time for me to start my own venture. Gotcha. Um, if you look at my back sticker, I also have a Mopar Mafia. Right. Um, I support TCMM, mm -hmm. uh, the syndicates, uh, Tri City. So I support all everybody. Kind of clubs. That's what's up, man. I like uh, that. We're Respect all one that. One family. You know, I wish everybody thought that way. To be honest, man. Yeah. And, and I'll be honest with you because you know, I just, I mean, this is my first Mopar right there. Um, so I'm, I'm new into the Mopar world. So, you know, coming in and then, you know, doing the YouTube and all that stuff, you know, I'm meeting people. And, and I'm realizing that in my short little time, a few months of, do, of being in the Mopar world, there's a lot of drama and beef for, like, for like nothing. There is. You know, but anyway, not, not to get too detailed in it, but just from the outside looking in. Because, yeah. you know, I, hey, you know, come hang out with us. Hey, come hang out with us. Hey, come do a video with us. And, you know, and then I'm like, okay, I'm like, okay, cool. But then, uh, 
you know, then some people start looking at you funny. I'm like, I'm just the guy just doing some videos, man, you yeah, know? Yeah. Uh, and again, like you said, we should all be one. You know, I just, I want to support everybody. I want everybody to get their shine on. I want everybody to, 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 you know, whatever they want to put out into the world, into the YouTube world, man, I want everybody to have that opportunity, right? Exactly. Everybody has the same opportunity to do, you know, as far as my platform, to be able to use it, you know, and I'm not selfish with it. Hey, let's, yeah, let's do a video. Let's do whatever you want to do, a shoot. Um, but like I said, when, you know, my little time that I've been in this world, in the Mopar world, and dealing with the different clubs, I've seen that some people are like, when they see that you talk to another club, oh, okay. Yeah. I'm like, you know. But yeah. Anyway, man, but like you said, man, it, that we should all be one family. We're all like the same things. We all. It's all about the cars. It's all about the cars, it's exactly. The and then we should keep it at that and everybody help each other out. And that's it. Exactly. So, I agree with you, man, that's 100%. That's I look at it. So, that's dope, man. Um, is there anything done to the inside? Uh, no. Inside is still stock. Inside is stock. Yeah, it's still stock. I like to focus more on the outside because right. no one really gets in my car. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I have the same way. I, trust me, man. I 100% agree with you on that. Yeah. But yeah, man. So like, again, man, this thing is super nasty, man. Super dope. Again, Lightning McQueen, man. This is a super dope theme, man. And you guys heard the man as far as what the inspiration is behind the man. All about the kids, man. And that's, you can't say enough about that and you can't respect that anymore, man. So anything else you want to tell him, Jesus? Um... Not really. I, I haven't really rehearsed anything. But <laughs> again, you know, I want to, I want to, I appreciate everything. I'm new here to Florida. I've only been here for six months. Oh, wow. I've okay. met a lot of, a lot of great people out here. Right. Um, I've met some really nasty people too. But you know what? At the end of the day, it doesn't matter. Right. Um, Keep moving. I love everybody. Um, I'm here to support whomever it is. Right. Um, and basically, that's it. Um, once you see me coming down the street, you roll at me, I'm going to wave hi to you. <laughs> if you got kids and they're interested, if they want birthday parties, I'll bring Lightning McQueen right wow. into the birthday parties. Um, that's, again, that's the reason why. What's, I hold on, I got to ask you though, what's your, what's your radius? Because, you know, people are going to be like, come to Miami. <laughs> it doesn't matter. What? I will travel. If I have to travel to Connecticut, if I have to travel wow. to Georgia, Texas, I will travel that's... to Texas. I, it doesn't matter to me as long as it's a special event for kids. Wow. I am there. Man, that's respectable, man. Respectable and commendable, man, like I said. Um, not, not, a lot of people, not a lot of people do that. They'll say it, but you don't really see it. You want to take a picture with it? Yeah. yeah. Look at that, man. Somebody. Take one with me next to it. <laughs> so I, I grew up watching that, and I uh, around by that said, there ain't no way there's a light in the queen here. <laughs> What's your name, man? Josh. Josh? What's yours? Gary. Gary. Hey, you guys are going to be on the uh, YouTube. Hell yeah. YouTube video, man. Make sure you guys go check it out. All right. What's All right. the? It's Fat Cat. F-A-T-K-A-T. Fat -T -K -A -T. Fat -Cat. You guys are from located here? No, no. I'm in Tampa. Oh, OK. So but you guys just doing a ride? Yeah, that, what, what, is that when you were right there? Yeah. No. This is a challenger. That's a charger. Yeah. <laughs> what is this? The Hellcat or that's the Hellcat? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, man. So make sure you guys go check out the YouTube channel, man. It'll be on there. And you guys will be on there too. You want me to take a picture for you? Yeah. I'm doing a photo shoot right now. Good job. Good job. <laughs> All right, man. Well, I appreciate it. What, what was your name again? Josh. Josh, man. It was a pleasure talking to you, man. What was your name? Gary. Gary, man. It was a pleasure talking to you guys, man. Um, we're going to finish up this video real quick before it gets dark. <laughs> I want to make sure it's a good video. Uh, it, it'll be up probably in about two days at least. About two or three days because I got a couple of videos. I'll let all my friends know. Let us subscribe. I got a lot of car prints. So there you go. For sure, man. For sure. Get that play yeah, yeah, exactly, man. I appreciate that. <laughs> All right, man. So, there you go, man. Perfect example of, you know, taking the time out to talk to. I don't, I don't know if you want to call them kids or not, though. Teenagers. Teenagers, right? Maybe. Um, late teens, maybe 16, 17, around there, maybe 18. Anyway, man. But perfect example of that, man. Took the time out. I actually stopped the vi stopped recording because. You know, he was just talking about a lot, a lot, a lot of different things, but <laughs> but there you go, man. But he's gonna, hopefully he does watch the channel, man. You guys are gonna see yourselves on there. Um, but there you go, man, perfect example. Like I said, taking the time out. It draws a lot of attention, man. They actually were across the street for a while. Yeah. A good yeah, five or 10 minutes just kind of looking, and then they finally, I guess, got the courage to come over and, you know, took a picture with the car and everything else. Although he did do the Wakanda pose. 
<laughs> he did, right? He did. I was like, wait, I was like, that's Wakanda, man. <laughs> anyway, man, but it's all good, though, man. Like I said, at the end of the day, this thing draws a lot of attention. A lot of people want to come talk about it, man. Obviously, it's a conversation start. I'm sure you get that all the time. Oh, yeah, all the everywhere time. Everywhere you go. So, yeah, man. So, like I said, dope car. Let me get that car in there real quick. Oh, let me get it this way. There you go. Let's see, I need you to be in the frame, baby. <laughs> So yeah, man, so dope car, man. Again, like I said, I appreciate his suit, man, for hitting me up. Um, he lives, man, how far, how long did it take you for you to get here? Uh, about 45 minutes. Okay, 45 minutes, man. So actually, so it's perfect because I'm about 45 minutes the other way. So oh, okay. I, we kind of met up in a, a, in a central location, uh, 45 minutes each way for each party, man. So it worked out perfect. You see Florida, man, it started to rain, but it, luckily it, it, it held up a little bit. But in Florida, man, that's what we always get. Yeah. Man. So can't can't ever get away from that, man. Especially in the summertime. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, you just got here. Yeah. So you don't know about it, really. Well, I've come out here eight times a year. That's why. Oh, I'm okay, I'm okay. So okay, got you. So yeah, Florida in the summertime, you're gonna get rain every single day, guaranteed, man, for at least 20 or 30 minutes, man. But anyway, again, man, I appreciate him for uh, 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 you know reaching out to me. Um, he actually knows Anti Venom. If you guys just seen that video I just did with the dope rap, um, he knows him and. Um, Basically, you know, they they talked or whatever. He reached out to me to come do a you know to do a feature on his car, which is greatly appreciated, man. Because I can never say no to getting dope cars like that, man. Look at that thing, God. Anyway, <laughs> so greatly appreciated, man. Again, if you guys got a car that you guys want wanted me to feature, man, like I said, hit me up. I responded right. Yeah. I and mean, some people probably think that oh, he's not gonna respond to me. Well, I mean, I'm gonna respond, man. So I'm gonna respond to you. We're gonna talk, even if you, you know. Just got questions or whatever, man. Go ahead and hit me up, man. Like I said, I, I'm always going to respond to you. Actually, I, re I responded to you pretty late too. Yeah, you did. Yeah, it was about late. Two in the morning, <laughs> I'm yeah. telling you, man. I'm always, I'm always around, man. Like I said, it doesn't matter when I read it or whatever case. I'm going to respond, man. I'm not going to just look at it and ignore it, man. So he could pretty much attest to that. But anyway, long story short, man. Again, dope car, man. Dope owner, doing it for a dope cause for the kids and everything else, man. He already said reach out to him if you want uh, the car to be you know, featured at a party or a, any kind of charity event, give them your Instagram one more time. Uh, it's speed underscore by underscore you. Okay, and there you go. You know I'm gonna put them on the bottom of the screen so that way you guys can make sure you spell it right. Hit them up. Uh, if you guys wanna do anything with kids or whatever, or charity, he's gonna be there, man. I'm gonna tell you about a couple of events we got coming up as well. It'd be cool to, okay. to have it there too, man. Uh, one more thing, I wanna put out my sponsors out there. Connecticut Children's Hospital. Thanks a lot for the support. And Foxwood Casino, we'll see you guys in August. There you go, man. So again, man, appreciate him again. Um, as you guys know, man, like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell, man. We got a lot of other things coming up. We got a lot of dope meets coming up. Obviously, it's summertime in Florida, man. That's all we do down here is meets, 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 man. And like I said, dope cars like this, we're going to be uh, featuring again or featuring more of. So make sure you guys hit me up or, or, or hit that notification bell because you don't want to miss it. Anyway, man, with that being said, you know I'm your boy Fat Cat, man. And from me and my boy, Hesu, man, we'll see you guys on the next one, man. Later. Look at this, man. This has been all day. People coming around, just checking it out, man. People stopping and looking at the car. What's your name is? It's uh, McQueen. McQueen, right? Yeah, yeah. Look at that. She came out to look at the car. Super dope, man. Super cool, man. I like this.